hello there. Grandpa went and he took this from the earth that he planted last year and they are right with the ripe and from this roots that you see over here we'll be making empanadas de yuca they're the ones that we put in the oven and they're delicious they are really good it's a lot of work but it's worth it but i just want to show you how they look at the beginning when grandpa just pulled them out of the earth this earth is good over here god give us so many things that they're eatable and I, we have to be thankful for that and we thank our heavenly father for that beautiful gift of being able to harvest from our own land i will continue look at this one this is a huge one just broken pieces. and this is what is this is what i'm doing right now i'm putting them in here i wash them up real good and after it's washed, then I cut in smaller pieces and it's gonna go into a machine, electrical machine that we have, and Hector will grind them. And this, this when this is all filled up, this pot is all filled up, then I just wash them up and give it to Hector. And it will take him less than 15 minutes. To, it took me over an hour to do, you know, to fill this up. Um, Hector will grind it in 15 minutes, more or less. We, and then after that, I do the preparations that I will show you later on, okay? This is the procedure to have this. It takes a lot of work, but it's so delicious after it's done that you forgot all about the work you have done because you make it with love for whoever eat it, enjoy it. I'm, I'm doing this on my own. Um, I need to have someone help me out to pour. This is like uh, oil, cooking oil with these little seeds there are called um and i put it here but this is a lot of masa i already add this i already add this adobo okay you know that and then you mix it up real good real good and you let it set you let it set okay this is a lot of this, it looks like a lot of oil but it is not and then when the juice of the meat, I will add some juice of the meat to give more flavor to this. And then will be delicious. But it'll take a while, okay? It's not just one, two, three. See, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna mix it up, but I don't have no one to help me. To hold, to take the movie, I'm gonna have to stop. And then I'll show you. And I'm gonna start doing the empanadas, okay? Because right now, I'm in the kitchen also here and browning this meat, this is beef and this is pork. I use this is the best lean meat, no fattening at all. I I brown this real good with a little bit of adobo. I'm browning this right now. I'm, I'm browning this. See, I'm here. I'm browning it. And what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna put toma tomato paste. I'm gonna dissolve it and I'm gonna add it in here. My sofrito and olives with the juice of the olives and the capers. Um, I need something that I don't have right now. Oh, 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 oh. How could I miss that? Um, I need cilantro and I don't have any. That's number one thing for flavoring, and I don't have any. I have it in the sofrito, but not in the extra. Well, I'm gonna have it without cilantro this time. It's gonna be taste a little different. The tree just give you a better flavor to the meats. But I gotta continue cooking this, okay? I'm gonna stop. Okay, this is the masa, which is already, it's almost ready, okay? Sometimes it's more yellowish. See the color, how pretty it looks? See it? Oops. <laughs> there it is. This is the banana leaf, what they're gonna be wrapped in. And this is the meat that is already been prepared. Okay, you see this? I just made it. I'm gonna let it cool off. And then when after it cool off, you see all this juice? Most of this juice goes in here. See, it goes in here and you mix it real good and you wait a while. That is, get together the flavors. Okay, I'll do that when the, it gets cool off. And then they're ready to be wrapped in here. 
And from here, they will go to the oven, and they wanna, I will show you how it looks when it's cooked and it's served. It's a delicious, delicious, delicious. You have the chance to taste it, okay? All right.